everyone and I'm doing another mall haul I know okay I know I said I only shop like big like a big shopping spree like twice you know a year spring and winter but this is like a littler mall haul and um, yeah that's my story I'm sticking to it actually I was like hmm I went to the mall to pick up some white denim shorts and I was just like oh, I went into Forever 21 and I was like mm, but this could be a cute little mall haul if I pick this up and then I could justify yeah shopping cuz I'm helping you guys pick out cute stuff I don't know that's my justification Okay. <laughs> anyways let's just get into it um I didn't really it's not actually that much so I have a problem and before any of you say oh my god like you always complain about money and like yet you're always shopping it's it's an addiction like I have a problem like okay um but it is getting better it is getting better I have to say um anyways okay so the first thing I the first store I went to was actually Forever 21 but I put it in my wet seal bag because I was guess I was consolidating as I was putting up my green screen over there so I kind of just started consolidating my bags so I don't have the bags but I did keep the tags um starting with the things I'm wearing now okay I know this is like totally like not really my style but um I actually had saw this on the Forever 21 website like the exact thing of the girl wearing this with jean shorts I thought it was really cute so I just picked up actually she had a red flannel but I picked up like a pink flannel shirt and um, this is actually from their Heritage um, brand, which is actually in our stores. I don't know if you guys have the Heritage in the Department 21, like in one, but, um, and this was $22.90, and then I kept the tag. And then the Nirvana shirt is actually a crop top shirt, and I actually tweeted a picture of me wearing this, and that is $14.80. And I'll just show you, but it's just, look at my blue gym shorts. It's just like a really, really cute crop top. Poser because I don't even really know Nirvana nor do I really if I tell you a song they sing I don't know I'm a poser whatever I just thought it was cute <laughs> um the next thing I picked up from Forever 21 was just this really cute cute dress and I liked it because it was more conservative um and it was like super like little house on the prairie right okay I'm trying to make sure did my shirt go up Sorry. Just in case it went up, we'll just show you again. So it's just like Little House on the Prairie, long sleeve sheer. And it's short. But it's super, super cute on. I know it's kind of like, okay, why would you get that? But it's super cute on. And I think this was actually kind of expensive. It was actually kind of expensive. My trip at Forever 21 on $24.80. Because I didn't really look at the prices. Because I always just assume it's so cheap. And then I realized I picked up really expensive things. <laughs> um, the next thing I picked up was... Uh, this is an ironic shirt. This is a shirt I'm going to wear for irony. And it's just this cheetah print, flowy crop top again. Love my crop tops. And it says fake because this is the label I probably get called the most. And I think it's going to be really fun to just wear it out of irony. And that was $17.80. But, uh. And it's also very, di there's like rhinestones. I know you can't really see it, but there's like rhinestones right there. It's like a studded fake. Um, and then the final thing is this, yeah, I guess that's all I got. What's the thing I'm wearing? Um, the final thing I got at Forever 21, which is this really cute, um, fitted leopard top. Ooh la la. I think it'd be really cute tucked into some jean shorts, because I'm, like, obsessed with jean shorts this season, so, yeah. And it's got, like, padded, um, bras, which is good, because, or, you know, I don't know what that's called. Uh, yeah, I guess, like, a built-in bra sort of thing. Um, so you don't really have to wear one. Um, okay, Yeah. <laughs> Then I went to the Victoria's Secret and I was really good. I didn't spend over $30. And I just, I actually picked these up because again, I'm under the influence of YouTube as I always say when I go shopping, which I am. I watch so many YouTube people, YouTube gurus. I watch people who have like two subscribers. I watch so many people. I subscribe to so many people on YouTube. So, um, but this was actually influenced by <laughs> GC Star. I have this, such a weird obsession. My sister thinks it's like not normal. She's like, you're 24 and you're watching a girl who's like 15 or something. I don't know how old she is, but she's so young. And um, I just saw this in one of her videos. <laughs> I'm like, I'm going to pick that up because that is Juicy Star. Um, granted, I'm a little bustier than Juicy Star, but it still was really cute on. And they were two for 28. So I ended up getting a lime green one because I'm obsessed with lime green. Oh, and I wanted to be twins with Zoom back here. That, I think that's really the reason why. Um... So that's what I got at Victoria's Secret. Then I went to, this is kind of like a more random mall haul for me because it wasn't my usual stores I go to. I actually went to a lot of stores I normally don't go to because it was a different mall, um, including Bath and Body Works and also Wet Seal. I like never go there. Um, but 
Bath and Body Works. I actually picked up some candles, again, because I'm under the influence of YouTube, and um, my sister always lights candles around our apartment, and it actually smells really good, so I wanted some for my room. And maybe I'll put it like right here and have it light as I as I film so it's very warm. Actually, this is um, the pink sangria and it smelled really good. I got the little candle of this because I was a little unsure of the scent. But do I like it? I don't know. I like the scent, but will I like it when it's burning? I'm not sure, but um, it was very summery. So I just got the pink sangria and the little candle. And then I got a big candle of my absolute favorite scent ever and that is the um, frosted cupcake. And oh my god, you guys. Oh my god, this makes me so hungry. Like, so, oh my god, I want to make a cupcake right, right now. But I think this is such a pretty scent when you, like, come into a house. It just smells like it's been baking. I love the smell of things baking. I don't know, maybe because I'm a fat kid and I love things baking. I don't know, but maybe I'll put that in my background. How does that look? And have a little, and have it burning. I don't get that trash can out of the way. I'm trying to organize this a little better, <laughs> if you will, because I've had some crazy-ass things back there that you guys have been noticing, so I'm trying to get it to look a little better. Maybe the candle will help. Um, I think I had like medication in one. Then you guys saw my whatever in the other. My little lingerie box. I'm like, oop, oop. Try to block it out. And then the last two things I got at Bath and Body Works were, um, these were actually just a dollar up front, you know. So I got them. This is the Malibu Heat Body Lotion. And she's like, are you sure you don't want it for a dollar? I'm like, oh, whatever. It's summer, okay, sure, throw it in. And then the other thing I got was just this warm um, vanilla sugar hand sanitizer, which I love their hand sanitizers. They're so little. I usually, like, just get them at CVS, but I was there, so I was like, okay, I'll pick it up. Okay. Oh, this is kind of boring, but I just went to my proactive kiosk and got some proactive. As you guys know, um, I've had to kind of switch to acne um, medicated cleansing system, so I just picked up the 90 day system. Proactive does help me get rid of my acne, um, as opposed to some of the other cleansers I was using, which I loved and made my skin feel really good. I had to use Proactive because all of my face would just be really awful just because of this medication, and I'm only on it for about another month, so hopefully, so hopefully my skin will get back to normal once I'm off of it. The final thing I went to, the store I went to, was Wet Seal. And I never really go in the store because I just never really liked it. I used to like it when I was really little, like living in California, but I never really got into it. Like, I don't know. I just always thought of it as just not really cute stuff. But um, I went into it because I actually found the denim shorts. They were on display, so good job, Wet Seal. I saw these on display, and I really, really, that's why I went to the mall to get white denim shorts. I got these really cute, um, and they say, we make summer sizzle. These were like the featured shorts. I'm like, oh, they must be cute. Um... And these were only $24.50, and they're really adorable. Booty shorts are really cute on. Um, I just I just like being comfy. Like, as you can tell, I got a lot of t-shirts and stuff for the summer. I'm just really into being comfortable in the summer, and especially the summer, because I had got so many bikinis, so I'm, like, expecting to spend most of my summer at the beach, so I just got t-shirts to throw over. And this was a really, they actually had these, like, 5 for 20. Um, I got these for, oh, hello, okay. For, this was just $6.50 because I didn't, I couldn't find like another color I liked. Um, but this was before Victoria's Secret, so I just picked up this v-neck. It's super plain, but it's super pretty. And I actually think I'm going to wear this in my next, I have to get headshots in a couple weeks, new ones. So I'll probably just wear this in my headshot picture. And I'm on this cheetah kick, obviously, which I didn't even really realize until I looked through all my stuff. And, um, I'm going to my shirt. I feel like this is like coming up. Okay. It's just this leopard skirt. Um, it's stretchy and it has one of those fold over bands. Let me just show you all. You can just fold them over like so. And it's just super cute. I was just thinking with like a black tank top. I don't know. I like leopard. I like cheetah print. Is that everything? That is everything. Okay. <laughs> so that was a mini mall haul kind of. I mean I guess it was more. But um, I know you guys like the mall hauls and so honestly like I like I said before I actually do kind of just like wait until one big trip but since I went there and I kind of looked around I'm like, oh, okay, that's you. <laughs> anyways um I hope you guys I hope I give you guys some ideas and you know because like I said watching your guys' videos you guys give me ideas so I'm hoping in return like the things I don't want bought from other people the stuff that I find on my own hopefully gives you guys ideas so anyways thank you guys for watching so so much and yay summer is here <laughs> I'll see you guys in my next video that's my new send off now. My high five. Bye. <laughs>